everyone, Effie here. This is my second eagle card today to celebrate Memorial Day. I stamped the eagle uh, off camera because I will link the video that I show you the stamping for this eagle in the description box below since this is the second video. I didn't want to be redundant and just show you the same stamping all over again. So after I stamped and die cut the eagle, I die cut our geometric circles cover plate die onto some cardstock and then adhered that uh, cover plate pattern onto a top folding A2 horizontal card base. Then I took the thank you word dies from our bold general greetings word plate die collection and I just measured the thank you onto a strip of watercolor paper and then I painted the top and bottom portion of this watercolor paper with red and blue watercolor paint and I'm using a wet and wet technique uh, so the paper is wet before I apply the pigment and I'm using a large Pentel Aqua Brush to paint today. Once I finished painting the strips, I dried my watercolor paper with a heat tool and then I die cut the thank you word plate dies right into that paper. After I ran the die and the paper through my die cutting machine, I just popped out all those letters uh, using an X-Acto knife and I just poked the tip into the poke hole. But make sure you save that negative piece because I'm going to use it to help me position my sentiment onto my card base. Once I figured out where I wanted my sentiment to be, I started adhering all the letters through the negative space using some liquid adhesive. I had taped that negative piece down with some micropore tape, uh, so I just lifted that negative piece off easily once I was done gluing down the sentiment. Next, I popped up my eagle onto my base using some dimensional foam tape, and then I stamped an additional sentiment from the eagle set with our noir dye ink onto some white cardstock, which I then just cut out and popped up right onto the base. And my card is now complete. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.